Hej, my name is Stefan Kjeldgaard. I'm a PhD student at Aalborg University with investors who is affiliated with the MadeFast research platform. My research topic concerns the design and evaluation of reconfigurable production systems to enable adaptability and resilience of a global production network. The motivation behind my research topic is that the turbines are getting bigger and bigger and that they're coming at a faster rate than ever before. Right now, or pretty soon at least, they are as big as the Øresund Bridge in Denmark. And not only are the components increasing in size, but also the manufacturing system and equipment producing those components as well. But it also carries other implications such as a higher rate of new product introduction, higher variety in volume within the production mix, more countries to serve and more factories to serve those countries, higher rate of uh, changeovers and also more lines, and also higher transportation expenses and higher capital expenses as well. My research hypothesis is that by introducing modularity to the manufacturing system, there is increased reusability and also faster reconfiguration times as well. Hopefully this will generate increased changeability of the network level to generate some improvements at the end. My research contributions follow this typical state scape procedure where there's requirement specification, conceptual design, detailed design, and implementation at the end, where some gates in between. So for the requirements phase, I needed to figure out what should be reconfigurable, where I made a method to screen the equipment in terms of reconfigurability prospects. Then I took the best one further to the conceptual design, where I made a mod modified method to design RMS concepts in terms of architectures, which also considered the value chain needs. Then again, I took the best one further in order to figure out why that was a good idea to convince people. So here I made a quantitative optimization model to evaluate the economic performance of the concept within the global production network. And then I took this further and made a 3D VR simulation model to evaluate the CAD and the process within the factory in terms to figure out when this should be implemented. The implications and the model results so far show that there is a reduction of capital expenses, which is primarily enabled by a re increased reusability and, and increased lifetime utilization of the systems. Also potential for reducing the production expenses, which is primarily enabled by faster reconfiguration times, which also generates a higher capacity utilization of the systems during those periods. Then there's also potential for reduction of transportation expenses because we can reuse the systems so we don't need to ship out as much equipment as before, and also increase vicinity of production to, to the markets. But there's also a sustainability aspect of this, because by reusing the systems, there can be a reduction of the steel consumption, and by increasing the vicinity of production, there can also be a reduction of the CO2 consumption. Thank you for your consideration.